What's up guys, PBD here and welcome to another episode of the Trophy Cabinet. Today's tournament is the Dutch Cup and this tournament required you to have one player from Feyenoord in the starting 11, one player from Utrecht and the rest of the players all have to be from the Eredivisie. I feel like we've played with an Eredivisie squad before in the Trophy Cabinet but we just haven't had to play with an Utrecht player which was a little bit of a downside because I had to sacrifice a midfield position for an Utrecht player which our opponent also has. He has the same exact player and uh, he isn't too great. However, we go into the final, we come across our opponent who has a pretty nice team, and something you guys should know about this opponent is I've come across him a few times in different tournaments in different rounds, and I think he's going to become a nemesis throughout the series now because I've seen him quite a few times and it's always a good match when we play. However, things did not start off well for us because in the 42nd minute, in the first chance of the game for both teams, our opponent is sent through on goal and we have to look at the mistake our defender makes right there. He commits to the ball, doesn't even get close to the ball, and with that, our opponent, De Jong, is through on goal and an easy finish for him. And we head to the second half, 1-0 down, stats are pretty similar, it's very back and forth, our opponent was lucky to have a good clinical chance and he finished it. And it was time for some subs in the 60th minute. I wanted to get a goal back because with one goal, we are back in the game. So we go ahead, bring on Narsing. We bring on Elias, some very fast players. However, in the 63rd minute, things would only get worse for us because our opponent has a free kick over here from a very dangerous area after the ref played advantage. And unfortunately, we, st we stole the ball and the, the advantage was still being played. So the ref had to pull it back for a free kick. Goodledge is going to step up for it. We try to put a guy in the line, but that free kick was just too good and it would always go into the back of the net. So we're down 2-0 in the 65th minute. Things aren't looking good for us. We're playing a very poor game. We aren't creating much chances. Our opponent is very good at the back, and we are not showing any signs of getting a goal. However, in the 71st minute, we would have a great chance from here. Guardado on his left foot. Unfortunately, it hits the post. Ilya tries to get the ball right there. Our opponent passes to Guardado, but the ref somehow calls a free kick right there. Apparently, Ilya committed a foul. A bit of a strange call right there and a little bit annoyed because we had the ball in the dangerous area. However, not too long after, in the 87th minute, we send Ilya through on goal. Narsing and Ilya, good partnership right there. Ilya cuts it onto his left foot, gets us a very important goal with two minutes left of the game. We go all out attack. Can we get the comeback? Can we take this to extra time? Well, in the 90th minute, our opponent started time wasting. We stole the ball though with Ilya. Ilya is going to swing in a low cross. Unfortunately, though, Milik can't get to it. And with that, we lose the final of the Dutch Cup. And the streak of winning every tournament is officially over. So anyways, guys, this is going to conclude this episode of the Trophy Cabinet. We have lost the streak. My name is Pippedeed.